what do you see what do you see your girl did her nails i have some new nail products i need to share with y'all today yes i do double dip double dip what why who let's get to it <laughs> Hello beautiful babes and welcome back to Sugar Fingers. It's your girl Sweet Angel and yes, we have an unboxing and we're going to have some fun with this box today. I was so happy that Double Dip reached out to me and sent me this wonderful gift today. And y'all, not only did I get a gift, but you have one as well. I do have a coupon code for all of my beautiful babes who go shop at Double Dip. You get 10% off. Just use my code SUGAR10. Now y'all, let's get into this box so that we'll know specifically what kind of nails we're doing today. I think the name of the company gives it away. Double Dip, absolutely. All right, beautiful babes, I do have everything all spread out. Pardon my nails right now. They are getting ready to get hooked up. You know my birthday is coming up, so you know your girl got to get these nails right. I just took off the set that I had on, and I'm ready to start over with something new and refreshing. Listen, you already got it. Double Dip is all about the dip powder nails. And this, I do have their dip system that is really easy easy to use and super affordable as well. We are going to have some beautiful nails right in the comfort of home. And you can too. Yes, you can. And again, remember my discount code, SUGAR10. Now let's get into what we have in this wonderful gift box they sent me. I have my dip powder kit instructions right here. I'm going to do my very best to follow this booklet because it's been a minute since I did some dip powder nails. And you know, I am not a professional. I'm just a girl that loves keeping her hands looking as fabulous as possible. So we're going to follow the booklet and uh, get into the great items we have here. The first thing I see I want to get into is this little bag right here. Oh my gosh, does it not have stickers? It does. And honey, I am looking at, look at there. Do you see what I see? Louis Vuitton stickers, okay. Oh my goodness, they are really trying to show out here. This is so cool and I am so ready for it. And we have Adidas stickers as well. Girl, they trying to get me into the big league, aren't they though? Let's just sit this aside and let's go ahead and take a look at this cute little brush that was included with the whole setup I have here. So I'm going to need this definitely when you're using dip powder, so yay for that. That is nice and soft, and it has cute little, you know, rhinestones all around it, which is cute. I think that's amazing, and we'll save this for last. Let's get into the box. This houses all of the liquids that we need. This is the Dip Powder Nail Essential Set with six liquids here. And it also has some instructions and information on the back here. But let's talk about what we have in the box. I'll just start from wherever I pull it out at. All right, we have the dip bun, which is right here. Next, we have the dip base. Number three, this is the activator. And it looks like it has numbers on the back side of it as well. So I'm going in order like one, two, and then three. And let's see if I'm still in order here. Let's go this way. Messed up there. Let's go this way. This is, well, it's number five. This is the brush cleaner. Now we have number four, which is the dip top coat. 
And finally, number six, which is the cuticle nourishing oil. Oh, I love oils. Let me see if this one has a delicious smell. Hmm, it smells like lavender. It smells really good. So I'll just toss the box here since I have all of those out. Okay, there we go. Now let's get into this little bag right here, which houses the dip powder. We have four dip powders and this bag is so cute. Let's just save it for, who knows, it might be a pleasant surprise for someone that I send a present to. You never know. Well, I have four dip powders, so let's talk about the colors that I have here. The first one here is DD543, which is a little bow pink. Beautiful. We're going to go ahead and open it up. I may need to get some tweezers if I can't grab it. There we go, I got it. Boom, there it is. It is so pretty. I mean, the pink on the screen to me looks just like what I'm looking at, so that is perfect. I'm going to put that inside of there and see if it can keep the powder in. And the second one here, this one is 588 Magnetic. Ooh, it looks like a beautiful gray, but it also looks like it has a little luminescence to it. I like that. But you know what? I've been doing different colors on each nail for the last couple of weeks. I think I want to do something solid this time. And then we have this one, which is 1376 Spring Goddess. Oh my gosh, that looks like what I want right there. That's beautiful. Look at the glitter in there. Oh my goodness. Y'all, I think I found the one. I think I found the one. Yes. And then the final one I have is 1345 Victoria Cameo. I think that's what it says. The end part is cut off there, but Victorian Cameo. Ooh, this one is beautiful as well. This is more like a grayish with shimmers in it but i think i'm sold on the other one i think i'm sold on this one i really think i am wow that's beautiful i'm not sure what i want to do i might just do this and maybe stud up one of my nails so we'll just set these aside for now now i'm going to go ahead and get my nails all ready and put on some tips and You'll be able to see that more than likely in another video uh, if I do record that because that'll be the first time I'm actually using tips on camera. So I may want to share the experience, but I'm going to get prepared and I'll be back and let you see me work these nails. All right, beautiful babes, I am back. I am using today my McCart full cover nails, but I've cut them into tips. So when I use this dip powder today, you know, I'm going to have to start covering right in this little hump here where my natural nail is and where the tip that I've made begins. So I'm going to follow the steps out of the double dip kit and the part that I am on right now, since I've already done everything else, like prep my nails, all I have to do right now is go ahead and start with the nail bond, which is going to be this one, dip bond number one. I'll go ahead and apply this to each one of the nails right now. I've already dehydrated my nails for the most part when I put on the tips, but I'm going to go ahead and do this part right now. So let's get started with that. And I think I pretty much need to only put this on my natural nail, but we shall see. And I guess I could wait for this hand, but I'll go ahead and do it now and try to get it over with. <laughs> All right, as mentioned, I am using Double Dip. The This is the dipping powder for the one I'm going to use in number three, 1376, Spring Goddess. These are my birthday nails. 
that I'm doing today. So I want to make it as fancy as possible. And I believe this will do it. It is a beautiful, beautiful shimmery gold flakes. And I think it's going to work out beautifully for me. What I'm going to do is find me a little scooper so that as I'm applying this, I can just scoop it onto the nails because I have an you know, like I said, that little portion I really need to work on to be sure I'm covering it perfectly. So I think I found the perfect tool. This is actually a swatch stick, but it has a nice little scoop to it that I think I can scoop up everything on there. I'm actually going to put my dip powder on top of an extra paper towel so that if I waste any, I can pour it right back into the container. And there we go. So we're going to get this process started. And we're taking our dip base, which is in the red top bottle. This is the dip base. This is what we need to use and apply a thin coat of the base to the entire nail surface. But remember, I definitely want to make sure I start with this rough edge first. Now, I forgot and I, now I remember, we do have the clear, let me find it over here. Now I remember it did not come with a clear. So I guess if I have a clear over in my stash, I'll use my clear versus using theirs. So let me go ahead and see if I can find that. I wish they had sent me everything and I wouldn't have to like mix brands, but unfortunately they didn't. Better luck next time. All right, I did find a clear dip powder. I'm not gonna call any names, <laughs> but I'm just going to use it in order to build up right in that little area and over my nail. And when I finish that portion of it, then I'll be ready to go ahead and apply the desired color. Again, starting with my dip base, and I'm just gonna try to scoop it onto the part that I need. So I'm just gonna apply the little dip base right here and try to build up this little area first. It says to quickly put it on there. So what I'm gonna try to do in order to make sure um, my brushes stay a little bit as clean as possible, I'm gonna try to hit each one of these with it. And then I'm gonna go in and start making them even out a little bit, so. Now wherever you put this dip base, that's where it's going to stick, so be mindful of that. It's been so long since I did dip powder. So now I'm going to take my brush and dust away any excess so it won't get on my brush that I'm using for the base. And we're going to re-dip again. It looks like it did a fantastic job at balancing that little piece out. Now I just need to get it where it's very smooth and that's what we're going to do now is smoothing out that little hiccup there that I'm looking at. Okay let's start with the pinky again but uh, this time I'm going to put it all over.
Okay, I'm just going to continue this process and I'll be back momentarily. All right, beautiful babes. So what I'm doing right now is taking my little buffer here and just smoothing out that clear powder coat that I put on so that hopefully I don't have too much buffing and work to do when I put on the color that I want of the dip powder. So that's what I'm taking time out to do right now. And once I finish this, I'll let you all see what that looks like. And if I need to add any more of the clear, I will be back in just a second. All right, now I'm excited. I've pulled out that pretty color. Y'all know this is it. And I'm just gonna wipe my hands off a little bit and make sure I've already dusted it with the um, brush, but I just wanna make sure there's no more residue on my hands before we get started with it. So same process. So same process. I'll take my dip base and then I'll go for it with the color. That looks like it's deep enough for me to dip my finger into it there. Mm-hmm. Pretty. I'm going to go ahead and switch out my brush and put it into the cleanser. Okay, I have that first one on. So this is what we're looking like right now. Looking really pretty. And I don't even have the top coat on yet. I think I'm going to dip this hand one more time. And let me go ahead and do that. And then I'll be back to let you see that. And then I'll apply the activator and we'll let it sit for a minute and then I'll apply the top coat. But if that's not a real beautiful birthday nail, I don't know what it is. Okay, so let me get to putting on the second layer of this color and then I'll be back when I apply the activator. All right, so I am back and I've kind of dusted everything off. Now this glitter, I see it's going to get everywhere, which is glitter. That's glitter for you, okay? So I've just been dusting it off as best I can. I'm going to go ahead and apply the activator now. And once that sets for 30 seconds it needs uh, to air dry then I'm going to use my buffer and buff it down a little bit just to make sure everything is good to go once I buff it and there's no issues I'm going to reapply the activator and once everything is good at that point I will go ahead and put on my top coat And now let's file and 
see what it looks like here. I'm trying to work it out the best I can. And that's what she's looking like right now. Are y'all ready for this top coat? If you say yes, I'm gonna get to it like right now. Okay. And this is the top coat. Let's see. All right, make that look a little bit more prettier. Okay. Yes, girl, yes. Speak to me. Oh my gosh, that is so pretty. I can hardly believe I'm doing this myself. Let me hide that other hand. <laughs> oh, that is so pretty. Do you see that? What I'm gonna do is go ahead and finish the other hand and I'll be back to let you see the final results of this beautiful double dip powder kit. Yes, double dip dip powder kit. There we go. All right. The nails are finished, y'all. Yes, hunty, the nails are done. I messed up my brush, y'all. But that's okay. We're going to fix that in just a moment. I accidentally stuck it in the wrong <laughs> thing. And uh, it's hardened up a little bit. So I'm just going to do the oil like so. And we're going to get her on these hands. Okay. We don't have a problem with it. Long as it ain't got no problem with us. Yes, so let me show you these gorgeous nails. Are you ready for this? Are you ready? I don't think y'all ready for them. Can you see that? Can you see that? Oh my goodness. I'm so excited. Bam. Will you look at those nails? Why don't you? Girl, stop. Y'all need to quit playing with me with these nails because your girl is getting almost good at this okay ooh, ooh, ooh. y'all need to quit playing with me about these nails cause your girl is in the house with it <laughs> yeah okay what I'm telling you that was so easy to do I love the process I do I do I do yes indeed and those are my birthday nails y'all yeah. If you like it, please make sure you let me know. Drop a like on the video. Subscribe to Sugar Fingers. Absolutely. Please subscribe. Okay. And hit the little bell. Make sure you, you know, hit that little bell. Say bing. And then, guess what? You'll be in the know each and every time I upload. And in the meantime and in between time, please keep those hands looking gorgeous. See ya.